Okay. I'll change the two to a three down there. Okay, there you go. Now that is oh, nailed three. it. What do you usually tell people if someone asks, hey, what's that job like? I love it. Just to be here, it's, it's awesome. I mean, say I get paid to watch baseball, there's not much better than that. When you're changing out a number, you've got it down where you can put one on top and the other one slides <laughs> right underneath. Like it's not a, I'm gonna pull this one off, then I'm gonna grab the other one, put it up. I mean, it is a fluid it's, it's motion. It's a fluid motion, especially when it's hot on a day game because they get hot, they're metal. <laughs> oh, and yeah. so you wanna make it as quick as possible. I do have gloves in my bag, just in case. What else do you have in the bag? What are the, uh, the necessary tools of the trade? Gloves, probably some sunscreen. Sunglasses, sunscreen, water. Uh, occasional margarita? No such luck. <laughs> Save that for after the game. Do you have a favorite memory sitting up here? It's been fun seeing the different players over the years from Lincecum to Hunter Pence was here last year, Tony Kemp, all those guys that you only think of in the big leagues have played here in our backyard. My front yard. <laughs> you know, this view, you called it, you called it your front yard. It's a nice view of Fresno Perfect. as the sun starts to go yeah. down. I get a different view than all our other guests do because I'm looking at them and the sunset, and the sunsets are spectacular, especially as it gets warmer. They're, the pinks and the oranges and the reds are absolutely beautiful. And then you have to put the numbers back in order. Oh. So it makes it quicker when you need them. Of course. It's a big deal. <laughs> Rookie here. The little things. Fox 26, KMPH. I got to put this one up. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a matter of where to put it and when. All righty, let's kill the music. All right, you guys know how those classic and musical chairs. I don't think there are a ton of manual I don't, scoreboards. Yeah, I don't know. So you tell me, why do we still need manual scoreboards? I think it keeps the history of baseball alive. Because once upon a time, that's all they had. And fans, we welcome you to Monday Madness. Like 